Welcome back to my channel or welcome if this is your first time here. I am Katie and today's video we are doing a whole house speed clean. We are getting a lot done. So if you are here and need for motivation, you have come to the right place. I hope you enjoy this video. As you guys can see, I'm starting out in the master bedroom today. There wasn't a ton to do in here, but it does always get dusty. As you can see here, I don't know what it is. About every few days, this is what it looks like. It looks like I haven't dusted in a month, but we are taking care of that today. We're gonna go wipe down all the surfaces in here, and then we're gonna move over into the boys' ba uh, bedrooms and then their bathroom, and then we will move downstairs. As you guys can see, I have my very own cleaning motivation on here while I'm cleaning in the master bedroom. I'm watching Tiffany Beeston. I've watched her for a long time. So I threw on her video to get the motivation to get up and get things done around here. Let me know down below. When you're watching my videos, are you up cleaning with me or are you sitting down trying to get the motivation to get up and clean? a second you're gonna see me hang a couple pieces of framed art that I had from downstairs and I decided to bring them up here to the master bedroom we actually have plans to put a sliding barn door right here just so we can have a little separation between the master bath and the bedroom my husband gets up and gets ready for work super early in the morning so we thought this might be a good idea just to keep the room nice and dark while I'm still sleeping but for now I already had these prints so I'm gonna go ahead and hang them on this wall just so it gives this wall a little bit of something until we can get that barn door put in Nothing 
plants grow and wake your heart is fire But baby, I bet you're cold without me Even when it's 90 degrees Without me, I bet that you can get in sleep In the bed, lying awake Cause I'm not there beside you Moving into my oldest son Rylan's room, we're going to make the bed, but first I had to show you guys he refuses to take these books off the bed when he sleeps at night. He likes to sleep with each and every single one of these. I don't know why, but I'm going to go ahead and attempt to remove them from the bed, get his bed all made nice and tidy, and we'll see if the books end up back on the bed at bedtime. Nothing's growing where your heart is fire, but baby... I bet you're cold without me. will actually be eight years old here in just a couple of weeks. I can't even believe it, but he is just so darn special. He is such an old soul and so mature for his age and so incredibly smart. Um, but as you can tell by his room, he like he's very particular about, about the way that he has things in here. So I like to let him do his thing and let him decorate his um, nightstand right here every once in a while and let it stay there for a little bit. But things do get dusty ever after a while and I do like to tidy things back up. So every couple of weeks I do come in here make him clean it up and get back to square one. But then he always ends up decorating it back with a bunch of his little trinkets and toys again. We've been on and off again and again I don't know which way we're going No control you Push me then you pull me back in Don't know if I can decipher How your mind works Yeah, you leave me wondering What it's like to feel your skin I will keep on trying till You give me a sign Give me a sign Ah, oh, give me a sign Baby, give me a sign. Just give me one more. You leave me hanging, begging for more. Think that I'm addicted to this. Can't resist to be a little risky and go for it. Cause I want you close. I'm so exposed when you're keeping me wondering. You know I'd do anything to be in your arms again. So give me a sign. When you guys watch these videos, what are your favorite parts? Mine is always the vacuuming. I don't know what it is about vacuum lions, but they are extremely pleasing and calming. And I honestly feel like you can clean a whole room and it just doesn't feel right until you vacuum and leave lines in it. It's just, it feels so good. So I hope you guys enjoy this little clip here as I leave a bunch of little vacuum lines all over Ryland's room. And there's no doubt that I should be with, that I should be. We've been on and off again and again. I don't know which way we're going, no control. You push me, then you pull me back in. Mm -mm -mm. We've been on and off again and again. I don't know which way we're going, no control. You push me, then you pull me back in. Mm -mm -mm. So give me a sign. Give me a sign. Oh, baby, just Ooh. give me a sign. Just give me one more talking to you and here we go again Staying up all night to see if you've been texting me Where do we go from here? I wanna go all in So give me a sign For those of you that are new to my channel, this is my boys bathroom that they use. It's just right off their little wing in the house by their bedrooms and it's just always a mess. I literally come in here every couple of days and have to do this. So this isn't a deep clean in this bathroom. It's more of like my in-between cleans, but I go ahead and hit the counters, the sink and the mirror, and then I end up taking their trash out and just kind of do a reset until they mess it all up again tonight.
this is so funny. This is straight up pool life right here. As many of you know, we put in a pool about six months ago and we're in that thing all the time, especially since living in Southern California, it gets really, really hot where we are. So we are always in that pool. So I had a ton of swim shorts hung up on their shower, drying out. And I feel like all I do is wash swim towels and swim trunks in this house. You guys notice how many stuffed animals I'm throwing out of this bed. It is absolutely insane. There had to have been at least 30 on there. And when he saw I was cleaning them up, he stomped in here and was like, what are you doing? And I had to tell him, look, we need to pick a few stuffed animals to actually have out at a time. The rest need to go in the bin, which you guys will see me do here in a minute. And we just kind of put them away and just kind of start over. But just like Rylan with his books, that's Colton with his stuffed animals. As I was cleaning in Colton's room, I started a vacuum and then my vacuum died. I've been vacuuming on max mode this whole time, so it finally just pooped out and I don't think I had charged it before this. So we're just gonna jump downstairs while the vacuum charges for a little while and then we'll go up and finish Colton's room and hit the loft. These videos are always so insane to go back and edit. I had been cleaning for hours, so I literally had hours of footage to edit, and it's so crazy how between just editing and speeding things up and making a few cuts here and there, how I'm able to boil down basically cleaning my whole house to 30 minutes. I so wish that I could clean this fast in real life, but it is what it is. But um, I hope you guys are enjoying this speed clean so far and we hit a lot of rooms and cover a lot of ground in this video. So hang in there.
Really quickly, I just wanted to thank you guys so much for supporting my channel. Just a few days ago, I hit a milestone and a huge goal of mine. I've now been doing YouTube for one year and my goal was to be able to register to be monetized and do an actual business out of this channel and I hit those goals of 4,000 watch hours you guys that's 240,000 minutes of watch time that you guys helped me achieve and just thank you so much for taking all the time to watch my videos you will never know how much it means to me I haven't eaten anything yet today. I do kind of do a little intermittent fasting in the morning. I don't have much of an appetite. So to ease into my day, I'm gonna go ahead and mix up some of my teamy greens here in my tumbler. You guys have seen me share these greens on my channel before and on my Instagram. And to be honest, you guys, I really do love these greens. I haven't tried any other of the Teemee products, but I really am enjoying this green superfood powder. Um, today, I'm actually gonna be enjoying it over almond milk with ice, but you can actually put a scoop in your smoothies or I even like pouring it over ice and apple juice. Um, it just makes me feel better. I do eat terrible, to be honest with you guys. So to be able to just throw a scoop of these greens in my tumbler and take it with me wherever I go definitely makes me feel a little bit better. I'll go ahead and link the Teamy Greens down below in case you guys wanted to read a little bit more about it. I even have a promo code I'll put here on the screen for you guys. But if you guys tried this out, let me know. I've really been loving it so far. Like I said, I'm just trying to get in a little bit of something and not a heavy meal, especially while I'm cleaning. I feel like that'll just make me want to sit on the couch and veg out. So along with my greens, I'm going to make myself just a little kind of mini charcuterie snack board. So I'm just going to show you guys really quickly what I like to throw together in just a matter of minutes. Um, like I said, it's super duper easy. So I was able to stop what I was doing, eat really quick, and then pack, pick back up on my cleaning.
right, now that I have some food on board and I feel like I have energy, I'm gonna get right back to it and that's finishing these dishes in the kitchen and then we gotta move on to the counters in here. I'm gonna show you guys again my decor that I put in in one of my last videos and also wanted to show you guys the new wood corbels I added to the cabinets on the one side of my kitchen, like by the lamp area. I would love to hear what you guys think of it down below before I make it a permanent thing. Right now, I just will have them stuck up there with some double-sided tape and I'm living with them for a little bit. So when I show that clip, please comment below and let me know what you guys think. Also wanted to let you guys know that in case you missed my getting it all done video, I do a lot of cleaning and some decorating and then I also show how I recently painted underneath my cabinets so they were white like the rest of everything. So I'm going to go ahead and link that down below in case that's something that interests you. With us it's all or nothing. To be daring, baby, dance the night away. I let my head down if I want. Don't you just get tired chasing fame and being pretty all the time? Doesn't sound like fun. You can do better. Let me show you what a good time looks like. You can do better. So much better. If I want Let yourself be free And maybe you will find That there is more to life Than being pretty Honey, let's just face it You can do better Let me show you what a good time looks like You can do better So much better I wanted to take a second to invite you guys to come follow me over on Instagram. My handle is here on the screen and I just show a lot more of behind the scenes over there. You can see more of my business and my personal life. Um, I usually just do more of like cleaning and lifestyle videos on here, not too much of like personal stuff. So if that's something that you guys want to follow along with, definitely follow me over there on my Instagram. We just do what we want to do. Yeah, no, nothing's complicated with you. Hey, we're playing songs on the radio. Sing along to the words that we don't know how. Brings out the wildness. Let's just run away. Yeah, I can drive the heart along. Being with you is like being on the road. Your house brings out 
wanna make you repeat it and repeat it again. Yeah, you make the sky so blue. No, nothing's complicated. out this after you guys you saw it looked like a bomb hit it down here I didn't clean for a couple of days which is actually really out of my character I'm usually like a clean as I go and pick up at night type of person but I just didn't have it in me the last couple of days so it was worse than usual but check this out these totes of just full of random decor are cleaned up and put in the garage. I moved some picture frames over here and I think it just balances out this sofa table so much more than just having the lamp on one side. So happy with it. I'm still loving the white curtains in here. If you guys don't know what I'm talking about, I did do a decorate and clean with me in my last video. So definitely check that one out. I will also try and remember to link that below. or running a diffuser are one of my favorite things to do while I'm cleaning or either after I'm cleaning. It just really takes the space to clean to just feeling like over the top. Um, I just showed you guys my candle lid right here really quickly because I'm actually using this as inspiration for the flooring that I want to put here downstairs. Um, okay, you guys, I have a vacuum again. We're back in Colton's room, running a vacuum and laying back down the rug and then we're gonna head out into the loft.
This is my loft area. When you get to the top of the stairs, my master bedroom is to the right and all the other bedrooms are to the left. So it's just kind of like a nice little buffer in between the bedrooms and I've been loving it being I'm the only girl in this household. I'm loving my privacy. But I just wanted to let you guys know that I'm only cleaning the first half of the loft in this video. The second half, I'm actually going to be putting in another video. I'm going to be transforming a space up here to do my virtual homeschool. And just so I have a nice dedicated place to put the boys and we can really sit down and focus being we are now going to homeschool. And to be honest, you guys, I'm really, really sad about it. This was going to be my first year having two kids in school full time. And now I'm going to be having them home 24 seven, which honestly isn't the worst thing in the world. My husband like sometimes gets really annoyed with me because I hate leaving my kids. Um, but it has been a long five months and I would do anything for a break. So to know that now we're going to have them home for the school year and I have to figure out this new routine and everything. I know we're kind of all in the same spot, but anyways, now I'm just going on and on, but I just want to let you guys know that I'll be working on the loft and the second half of the loft will be in one of my upcoming videos. Okay, you guys, I'm super tired. I think that I'm gonna go ahead and just in this video here, um, I didn't clean everything that I wanted to clean today, but I got pretty close. The only spots that I didn't get to today was my office, which I don't usually do on here. Um, my stairs, the second half of the loft, and my master bathroom. Everything else I got to, and it feels so good in here. Um, I'm still pleased with everything that I got done today. I think I might pick up on this tomorrow. Um, I do want to get my part two home tour up for you guys as well as film a um, homeschool room. I'm going to be setting up for homeschool since my boys will be doing 2021 school year virtual homeschooling officially. I know the there's just craziness going on in the whole country, but California is on a whole other level. I'm just going to leave it at that. But that's kind of where we're at with that. So I just wanted to kind of let you guys know what to expect here on my channel. So lots of cleaning, home tours, um, homeschool, setup, decor, like getting totally dialed in. They go back to school in two weeks. Um, I think I'm also gonna be doing some grocery hauls and stuff coming up. And then pretty soon we're gonna be rolling into fall hauls and decorate with me's and stuff like that. So make sure you're subscribed so you do not miss out on any of those videos. Also, please like this video. 
if you enjoyed it. And other than that, I'll see you guys in the next video. Thank you so much for watching. Bye. Tonight we're running